for your lives. It's a 5K marathon slash obstacle course through the woods. In addition to that, there are people dressed up as zombies. So you're literally running for your life. Subaru actually gave them a car to use uh, and gave them also advertising dollars to use. So we wrapped the car for them and they're actually gonna be bringing the Subaru to all the local dealers and putting it on display for a day or so to promote the event. The vehicle wrapping is actually a new product for us. Uh, we've been installing vehicle wraps for a little over uh, two years, but we decided to bring the whole production process in-house. We just bought a state-of-the-art HP printer, as well as hired on a full-time graphic artist. So we are a one-stop shop for anyone that needs their advertising uh, on their vehicle. Vehicle wraps are used more so now for um, advertising. This is just the main thing. We've never done a wrap that had a shotgun or a machete on it, which was kind of interesting, um, or splatters of blood. What I look at the most when I look at the zombie escape vehicle, probably the blood splatter that's all over it. It just had that riveted look, uh, the blood splatter look, it all just, it, it wrapped really well into the theme of what the event was about. There's a lot of time and effort put into the application of the film. At first glance, you're going to want to thank that it's a paint job. The vinyl is so thin, it forms so well to surfaces that it will look like paint has a put over that car instead of vinyl material. To actually paint a vehicle in that type of way would, would be outrageous in cost. We take a lot of time and energy in making sure that uh, when we are applying the film to the contours, we're not overstretching or pushing the material beyond its limits. Every vehicle is different, some are harder than others, depends on the, the curvature, um, it's like trying to wrap a piece of paper around a basketball is how I like to explain it to people which trying to do that without having a crease in it is going to be pretty difficult. The bumpers, um, they were more aggressive, more deep curves, and you just don't see too many people installing those because they're just very difficult to do. Sometimes these bumpers are, are, are really contour, really complex, so we have to heat the film and really lay it down smooth and wrap it fully around, um, get it in all the grooves, get it in all the body lines, um, just to make it look like a, a paint job, really. The design was so radical, the vehicle was so radical. Everyone was really excited about the process. Everyone really wanted to finish this thing, see it to the end, and get involved in it. Turnaround time on this, I would say about two days. We have multiple people here that are able to do the process, uh, to do the installation on a moment's notice. Driving the SWRX was probably the most fun I've had driving a car. Not only does a car drive great, but with that wrap on it, everyone was noticing. Um, just driving down like neighborhoods to uh, we stopped by a school, like heads are just turning instantly. It was a great design on a great looking car.